guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're well i hope you're all having a fabulous week i've got a very highly requested video for you guys today and i'm so excited i've been looking forward to film this video for what feels like a eternity but we'll get into that so if you don't already know what this series is all about jody tried and tested then it's basically where i try and test different brands that you guys may be skeptical 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 that you may be you guys are a little bit wary of and you're not sure whether to shop on them you don't know what the quality is going to be like basically i'm just the guinea pig for this whole channel and i will test the brand spend my money so you guys know whether you should or not so we have got today sheen literally all of my friends love sheen they rave about it i see so much on tiktok and instagram and i was like i'm gonna try to say it for myself because i see good things and i see bad things so i thought i will just try it i've done a huge order by huge i literally mean huge i've ordered so much a lot of different things very like spring summer appropriate but also like a lot of basics accessories bags jewelry you know like we've got a whole range of items so if you want to see my full review on sheen then please keep watching okay so i'm just gonna get my phone up just to see what the delivery times and everything were so my parcel came in two i think some come from the uk warehouse and then some come from like the chinese um so obviously the chinese one took longer so i made this order on the 19th of april and my first parcel come i got some fluff. my first parcel come i think within like five days like i was very impressed maybe like four i think i ordered on the tuesday night and it come on the saturday so and it was standard delivery like i didn't pay at all i don't think and i also got a 30 percent off code so definitely check for those um and then my second parcel literally i have got something on my see it in my eye by the way guys excuse my lash extensions they've been on for like a couple of weeks now and they just look you know a little bit crazy um yeah and then my second package come today so it took from the 19th one week so it took 16 days two weeks um obviously that's with bank holidays and weekends within so it's not crazy like I don't know if you guys don't mind waiting two weeks i was getting a little bit impatient but then they did email and say like there's a bit of a delay of your order it is coming from china you're not paying a lot for delivery so i do get it like i don't really expect anything different but yeah let's just get into it i'm gonna start with the one thing that i've actually worn because like i said i got this part of the parcel like two weeks ago <laughs> so i picked up this really cute baby pink tracksuit now at the time i didn't realize when i was ordering it but when i put it on i realized that it's a pangea pangaea i'm not sure you say it dupe so obviously it's got the writing on and it also comes with a cropped hoodie which i really like so it's just like this and it's got this little bit of writing on now this is what it says it should be from the like to get power and happiness not spend all the power and happiness to like hope you know now you guys take that as you will i don't really understand what that means but it's just a cropped hoodie it's got two pockets and then also the joggers are just like a really nice waist they haven't got a band but they are quite like snug and then cuffs at the bottom they again have got the writing on they've got pockets which i like and i picked these up in a medium because i wanted it to be slightly oversized it is fleece inside it's not the thickest of materials but I think it's quite a nice like summer tracksuit. I do really like it. It looks really good on. I have worn it. I don't think I've got like a picture in it. But I think I have got like a random selfie or something. So I'll put it on the screen. So I got this for £14.50. Which obviously for a tracksuit is amazing. Okay guys I'm just putting the tracksuit on. Obviously I've already tried this on. And I love it. It is slight, not like see-through, but I was wearing like a luminous pink bra and you could kind of see it. I don't know if you can see that, but then like I wore it with a white top and it was fine, but how cute. So I picked up this little gym cohort. Now my friend Mia also picked this up. She did an order, I think like a couple weeks before me and she also picked this up and she was super impressed. It's supposed to be like a Bowen T dupe from last year. Um, I'm not sure exactly how this will actually fit and look. Like my mum kind of was like, it doesn't really feel like gym material. It doesn't have any padding in, but it is just like this green and pink flowered sports bra. Then I also picked up these come separately. 
these little shorts and they've got ruching up the side um i don't know if i'd ever wear this to the gym like i don't know how it fits i'm sure we'll see in the try and clip but i think with just like a little cardigan throw over or something it could look quite cute in summer i picked the top up in a small and the shorts <laughs> Shorts up in a medium. I'm going to have to do the school run. So the shorts were £4.90 and the top was £4.50. So obviously it's less than £10 for the set. So Okay guys, I've got the gym set on and I don't think you're ready. I mean... I'm pretty impressed. I mean, I'm not saying I'm going to rock, rock up to my leisure centre gym wearing this. But maybe I am. Maybe like as it gets a bit sunnier, like it's actually not as bad. Like they don't come up as high as I thought. Like I kind of thought they'd be here. And you can pull them down. And if you undid the ruching slightly, then you could pull them down a little bit more. But I actually think it's really flattering and I'm actually like shock. The top is really I mean it's not gonna be is it? It's not gonna be the most supportive, but it's not bad. Like it's obviously got no padding in, but I mean, you could put pads in. You could probably wear some sort of strapless bra if you needed to. Honestly, guys, get this set. I'm telling you, you need to get it. Okay, so the next thing that I picked up was... Just zip this off. This, like, creamy... Oh, it's just, like, a cream um, unitard. It's ribbed. It feels pretty thick. If this isn't thick... Oh, it is really thick. If this isn't... If this isn't see-through, I think it'll look gorgeous. Uh, it's literally just like short shorts. It's got a high neck and also the zip, which I like because you can obviously have it as high or low as you like. I kind of like just having it a little bit open so I'm not suffocating. But I picked this up in a medium because I didn't want it to be like stretched over my bum and go see-through. But I just thought this was a really good like summer staple. I'm really into unitards right now. And that was £10.90. Okay, guys, this is the unitard. Now, it is so tight, and I'm pretty sure this is a medium. It's not see-through, though, because I don't think it's see-through. I've got pink pants on, so you'd probably tell. Everything, show everything shows up so much more on camera than in real life, so I don't know if this is see-through or not. The only one, it was so hard to get in into. Like, this literally had to be, you know, like when you can... Hello, can you please say hello because you never come on YouTube anymore. You never come on YouTube anymore. Say hi everyone, I've missed you. But we're going to vlog next week, aren't we? And you'll be back. Say yes. Say yes. Say yes. Sasha actually got stamped on by a deer yesterday. It was so traumatic. I mean, she didn't even like blink an eye. But she just wasn't really that bothered. But long story, I'll tell you in a vlog. But she's fine, but I was traumatised um the problem that i had was i couldn't get the zip like straight to zip up so i had to like poke it through the front now i can't seem to poke it back i mean i definitely would be like if i had something pokey I'm not sure about this like it's not the worst like it does fit nice now it's on but it's just one of those things that i probably just wouldn't reach for in my wardrobe so next up i picked up kind of like the same thing but a long legged long legged is that right and long sleeved you i'm not you just had like it's like a jumpsuit like an all-in-one so it's just like this beige ribbed number and it says lucky arm which i'm not really that bothered um i thought it had oh yeah it does have thumb holes i love them with thumb holes i just think it makes it look really seamless and really flattering i've got one from plt similar it doesn't feel like super thick it's definitely very stretchy so i'm just hoping it's not See through i don't know that was 11 pound 54 but that is with 30 percent off but i'm sure there'll be a code um i wasn't sure on sizing like i'm normally a size eight and like 10 in bottoms so i just wasn't sure like i didn't want to get things and then come tiny and i couldn't get them on so i probably overestimated how like what would what would fit me <laughs> okay guys this is the other like unitard jumpsuit i think it's so cute the sizing is definitely inconsistent as that is this is a size i'm sure this was a medium right 
yeah so this was a medium and it was small and this is a medium and i genuinely could have got like two sizes smaller like it's fine like it does fit it's just super like comfy and it's not that tight um i can't tell if it's see though i don't think it is it's definitely not on my pants but i love the hand detail in there i think that's so nice i think it'd look cute with what i was wearing for like an extra layer Yeah, like how cute does this look with like my Zara sneakers and like a little black bag or something. Let's do dresses because I only picked up two. So first off, I got this. Like, it was called like Marvel Effect. Little like literally simple bodycon midi dress. It's kind of like scuba material, which we all know I'm not the biggest fan of. But I just thought oh well it's cute like i thought with a denim jacket this would be really nice or like a white shirt on holiday like with sandals i just thought this was so nice i picked this up in a size small and this was seven pound 70 and then i picked up another mini dress which is this like tie dye one got this in small it was 11 pound 20 it feels quite thick to be fair. It's just like a nice ribbed material, black and white. Okay, so this is definitely bigger and longer than I was expecting, but I think I kind of like it. I wish that it was in a smaller size because there's just like, it doesn't really do much for the shape. Like that's how long it is. It's literally like only just above the knee. I didn't, on the picture I'm sure it was like mini, I don't know. Okay, so this dress definitely gives more shape. I do actually quite like it. It is longer than I thought it would be, but I love it. I think it's like with a tan, like I'm literally the palest I've ever been right now. So um, with a tan, I think this would be so nice. It gives a little bit more shape. Like it doesn't give much, but it definitely is tighter. So long is. <laughs> so onto like dressy tops. I'm really excited about this one. I'm just hoping it looks as nice as I thought it would. It's this really cute, like, red crop top. I, th like, I never wear red. I love this. I think it's so cute, like, with denim shorts, with leather. So I got this in a small. This come in a lot of colours as well. And this was £8. This is the top. I think it's so cute. Obviously, it needs to be a bit more like that. Um, but I think with these jeans and some heels, it could be so nice for, like, a meal when we can eat indoors. <laughs> is it from the back i think it's really cute like i think on holiday this will be a dream even like with a little white skirt or something and then i got this top which i've heard so many good things about and seen literally everywhere but it's gonna be right that's the back this will be better to show in the try and click guys. So it's like a corsety at the bottom thing. Like it's got like an underwire. And then it basically like wraps over the front. And like your boobs just kind of sit in the hole. But it's meant to be amazing. Like I've seen so much. Um, so many good reviews on it. And it's got a really nice like band here. Which should like hold you up. I got this in a small. And this was seven pain, Which is great. Because I've literally heard so many things. It comes in a lot of different colours. I mean, you'll see in the try and click, guys. I'm probably making it look absolutely ridiculous. And you're probably all thinking, Jodie, what the hell? Okay, guys, can we have a moment of appreciation for this top? And just for Sheen in general, really, for doing this top? It's so nice. I mean, I did, like, have to kind of have a little bit of an assault course to get it on. But it is so good, like really lifts really holds like you're not popping out like it doesn't make it's not logical sense this is it from the back so it's literally just square it is so nice like it's such a nice like going out top the only thing i will say is i definitely could have sized day one um because it is a little bit gapy here i think it'll be a lot more flattering if it was like tighter but i suppose i could just maybe get my nan to take a few inches off the straps just to like pull it a little bit more yeah really happy okay so this is kind of a dressy tart but i'd probably just wear it casually um it's just this really cute like blush pink but then what i wear i'd probably wear this out actually like under a blazer i think this is so cute it's like a really nice like um like dusky pink color it's obviously got this really nice bit of like ruched material here which i think will look so flattering it's obviously long sleeves ribbed 
cropped just like a nice cropped length but you'll probably still be warm i think this will be great for like pub gardens right now um so small and it was 450 this is so cute it definitely is tight like it is tight on the arms but it's not too tight like i have got room um i think like with a tan this will look so nice i feel like that could do with like being a bit more down i think that looks better um give me some good support guys i feel like it's been so long since i've actually just like sat and hauled stuff for you like because i i think the last haul video i did was that miss pack one but i like pre-filmed that as well so i feel like i haven't sat i'm kind of feels like foreign to me and also on the 1st of may i have been on youtube for one year can you believe that like if you've been here from the start then like it's gone so quick but at the same time it feels like i've been filming and doing it forever not forever but like for a long time it's so strange and um, yeah so thank you everyone thank you to even if you've just found this channel today like thank you i appreciate everyone so much but i just can't believe it's been a year like it's crazy so next up i got this top in a small and it's just literally like simple white top i'm kind of into pink now guys i don't know what's happening to me i just thought that paired with like blue jeans or even just like leggings that was 450 again okay i this top definitely ruined the slick back vibes i have got like a leopard print bra on so you probably can see but i just wouldn't wear a bra of this this is definitely a bit of a weird don't know if you guys can tell but like here it keeps like pulling up and like kind of like bagging here like even when you pull it down like it's it's as if it's like been shrunk in the wash but i think like under a blazer and like with these jeans it does look really cool this one i'm really excited for it's like a gray version of that kind of but i think it's a little bit more oversized yeah i got this one in a medium because i wanted it to be a bit more oversized i think and it's literally so simple again. I don't know what it says. I hope it doesn't say something stupid. Go where you feel most alive. And it says one wonderlust. Is that how you say it? You say wonderlust? I don't know. Golden sunset. But it's just a really cute like charcoal grey with obviously a little bit of um graphic. A little bit of a graphic on the front. Um quite oversized which i wanted and i think this paired with like blue jeans and jordans will look so cute like this is the great top it's actually not as big as i thought it would be um but it is cute i do wish like maybe i got it in like a large or an extra large just because it is quite like tight i don't know if you guys agree but i do like it it will look so nice with just like joggers i'm just obviously pairing it with these Sarah jeans okay so this sweatshirt which i'm about to show you was 10 pound 80 and i my mom did like this when she like quickly had a look but i'm looking at it and it kind of looks like a weird color i don't know like it's not chocolate brown it's like quite a strange brown but does it look it looks more like dull on the image definitely is a bit more like i don't know but i do i do like it. i got this in a large because i wanted it to be huge okay so this is the sweatshirt on i still stand by the fact it's like a weird color it is so big and you guys know i love like oversized things but i think because it's so thin it doesn't like it doesn't have much structure so like it's kind of just bag in but it is really comfy like just to throw on on like a sunday god i think this is the biggest haul we've ever done guys this is the last clothing item i think it's literally just a really simple bright cobalt blue oversized tee it says brooklyn 90 no 1898 new york and this gave me like friends vibes like i can imagine chandler joey rachel monica walking around in this and i just thought hey cute i got this in a size large and it was five pound i just thought this was nice like it's not super thick or anything but it's just nice oversized slate che okay so this is the t-shirt it's definitely not as big again as i thought it would be it's so weird like i thought this would be huge um so i wouldn't be able to wear this as a t-shirt dress i could definitely wear it for so clean shorts i obviously wouldn't wear it with these jeans i don't think maybe like tied could be quite cool okay yeah i think that looks better now on to accessories so i picked up two bags i don't know why i got purple guys like it's cute don't get me wrong 
but I just think like I would never probably reach for that because I don't wear purple it was literally just a little shoulder bag like it will be cute I suppose with black um just brighten up your outfit I suppose you can do some like color blocking it's got like ruched detail on which is like one of the Prada 2005 re-editions um, this was £3.15 and the last bag I picked up was this again like Prada kind of dupe it's just like a nylon bag they definitely need like putting stuff in to kind of get their shape but I thought this one was cute I don't know it kind of just looks a bit floppy and that one does like but then I suppose if you just like need a bag then it will probably be okay this was £2.80 finally I picked up some jewellery bits so I picked up this massive pack of rings these were only £1 and I just thought like I need just like random rings just to like put on like if you just want to feel a bit more extra and you can layer them and sometimes like you just don't want to spend like £50 on a ring when you went like eight on I also picked up this 2000 necklace I'm born in 2000 I'm a 2000 baby and I just thought this was cute again just to like layer on a night a eh, when you want to just wear something different because I literally wear the same jewellery every day and I also picked up this really cute it's like just a really simple chain and it's got a tiny little butterfly on which I thought was so cute. It's kind of like jeweled. I don't know if the camera will like pick up on that, but I just thought it was cute. Again, just to like wear on a night out or something. The 2000 one was 70p and this one was 70p. So I've just tried everything on and I'm actually like really quite impressed there was only a few things obviously that you'll have seen that i was a bit like mm, not sure the sizing i would say is a little bit inconsistent everything was obviously super affordable um shipping wasn't dreadful i think that probably mine just got held up with like the pandemic and everything which is understandable a lot of parcels are taking longer to arrive so overall i would give it a good <laughs> recommendation i would say and like a good review i would say that i approve so I've always been very sceptical of like my friends shopping there and I'm just like oh yeah whatever but I actually think I would say I approve quality wise I would just check the reviews for things before you order them so I hope you guys all enjoyed the video you can just skip to the actual outro now I hope you guys all really enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe and give it a big thumbs up if you did it would mean the world to me everything will be of course linked in the description box and I always if you haven't watched my channel before I always asterisk my favorite must-have pieces like once I've kind of tried everything on styled it had more of an experience with it so definitely check the description box out for that I hope you guys all have a lovely week and I will see you on Sunday with a huge PLT haul. Hauls are coming back. Bye guys.